course, as the action picks up inside the arena where you are, there's also a lot happening outside of the arena. Fans traveling from far and wide and descending on downtown Albany. News 10 ABC Zion Dakota live from the fan zone with more on the crowds there. Zion. Good afternoon to you both. You know the excitement is alive here in downtown Albany. Most of the fans are inside the arena now for the big games that are set to take place. Go Irish! Woo! On Friday, fans came from far and wide for women's basketball matchups. Jack Ridley and his family drove from Virginia. You drove how many hours? To come? Eight hours, sir. And it meant that much to you to come here? To yes, sir. Yes, sir. He came this far for one reason. Don Staley went to the University of Virginia, and we followed her when she was there. And She's done an amazing job. Men and women alike were enthused for the weekend of women's basketball. A Clark fan all the way, and I had an opportunity to get tickets. I got them. I love it, and I'm just glad to be here. One thing that stood out was the inspiration young girls felt from the enthusiasm for women's sports. I've been taking a lot of sports classes in my school, and we're learning a lot about basketball and March Madness, and all of my classes are mainly focused on men's March Madness, so I really wanted to see what women's was like and bring it back to my class to talk about. Talent is just as good if as the men's basketball, so I think it's nice that people are realizing that and like enjoying the sport more. The Capitasto sisters, who came from Massachusetts with their family, told me what they loved about the sport they played. Get to I love that there's so much energy and teamwork involved in all of the sports. Say go South Carolina. Go South Carolina. Yeah, tomorrow will be an IO year. <laughs> Now the big women's basketball games continue through Monday here in Albany, live in downtown Albany, Zion Dakota News 10, ABC. That's good stuff, Zion. Lots of excitement, no question. News 10 will continue to follow all of it for you in Albany as the games continue into the weekend. Great matchups tomorrow, UCLA taking on LSU and Colorado up against the Phenom herself. Caitlin Clark and Iowa, you can watch those games right here on News 10 ABC.